Hello everyone and welcome to a little preview video. You may notice my face is missing, but that is because this video is not about my face. It is about the F124 pre-order liveries. Thank you very much to EA and Codemasters for providing a code to have a quick look at the new liveries that have been added to time trial in F123 if you have pre-ordered F124. And if you haven't pre-ordered F124, well, if you're interested, you should really get on that. It is set for release on the 31st of May, so not really too far away. Right, so if we head over to Time Trial, we now have two new menus titled F1 2024 Preview and F1 Sim Racing Preview. This pre-order bonus includes four liveries for F1 2024 and two liveries for F1 Sim Racing featuring the McLaren and Alpine eSports teams. The 2024 preview liveries are Alpine, McLaren, Haas, and Williams. So we're just going to dive in, take a quick look at them, and then I'll show you some shots of them on track in Bahrain, which if you are up on your F1, is the opening race of this season and is taking place today. We're going to start off with the new McLaren eSports car for this year, and to be honest with you, I actually kind of prefer it to the F1 car. Yes, it does have a lot more exposed carbon fibre, which has been the largest complaint of this year's liveries, having too much black and too little colour. But I actually kind of like this, and I quite like the way that it has the sweeping black nose instead of orange, although 90% of it should still be papaya. Next up, we have the Alpine F1 eSports car, which doesn't look anything like the actual Alpine car, which I find a little bit weird, but it does have a very nice modern, shiny look to it. Although it uses a lot of red, which is interesting, because Alpine doesn't, apart from its lovely little French flag at the back of the car. But it does look quite nice overall, and I guess considering it's an eSports car and not an actual one, they can afford to put a bit more colour on it. Okay, on to the F124 cars, and now if you've been watching F1 you will have seen all these liveries already, but it is very nice to see them rendered in-game for our use, so we can have a little pedal about all the tracks with it. And uh, I'll show you a little bit of footage from Bahrain, we'll have a nice little montage of the other cars on track after this. But yes, here is this year's McLaren, again, mostly black, but still a nice splash of the papaya. And it does look pretty good, actually. The chrome wheels are here to stay, and they look... They look okay. And then we have this year's Alpine, which I'm filming this right after qualifying for Bahrain. Alpine have put in a shocking performance today, unfortunately. And it appears that stripping most of the colour off their car has not done them any favours in the speed department. So I'm not a massive fan of the Alpine car this year, I must admit. It seems to be quite slow and also is basically just a black car with some colourful stickers on it. Although I will say I do quite like the pink and blue wheels. Next we have Williams who are staying with the fantastic Duracell sponsorship up on the top there, which I do really enjoy actually. And a lot of people making jokes about Komatsu sponsoring this car, given that the new team principal at Haas is called Komatsu. So there's a lot of jokes to be made in there and a lot of very easy jokes to be made in there. But the Williams does remain very nice looking. And then finally we have Haas, which is even, well, even more devoid of colour than any other car on the grid, because basically what they did from last year was invert the colours of their livery. But I tell you what, it does kind of cut quite a nice clean look anyway. And there we have the six new liveries added to F123 if you have pre-ordered F124, which again comes out at the end of May, so not long to wait now. I'm going to leave you with a little montage of the cars on track. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. And I'll see you at the end of May when F1 at 24 launches properly.